Today is Thursday, November 12th, and as of right now, Bitcoin is trading for $16,000 per coin. I really want to get into all of this cryptocurrency action now, so with that being said, let's take this shovel, put it into the ground, and start mining for some Bitcoin. Guys, I'm obviously not that stupid. I know I can't just mine Bitcoin by digging in my backyard, but in all seriousness, if you guys were living under a rock since 2017 and don't know what Bitcoin is, well, it's a decentralized, unregulated currency based solely on supply and demand, and I like to think of it as cash for the internet. Over the past several years, the prices for this digital currency by the name of Bitcoin have absolutely skyrocketed in value, and this has caused a massive wave in a new industry by the name of Bitcoin mining. This is basically the equivalent of all of the people who were digging for gold in California back in the 1850s. At first, in the early 2000s, Bitcoin mining was super easy to get into as all you needed was your laptop to start mining some Bitcoin and making some serious money. But now that the price for a Bitcoin has absolutely skyrocketed and the industry of Bitcoin mining has become much more well known, the business has a much higher barrier of entry and the people actually making money with it own mines with thousands of supercomputers worth millions of dollars. After reading up on Bitcoin mining, I determined I really want to get into the industry, but unfortunately, all I have to get started is a four-year-old PC my dad bought me for Christmas. So for the next week, I am going to be mining Bitcoin on my PC in hopes that I earn enough money to buy that Lamborghini I have always dreamed of. When I first wanted to start mining Bitcoin on my PC, I had no idea how to get started, so to solve that issue, I did what most people my age do, and I googled it. From there, immediately a YouTube video popped up explaining how to start mining Bitcoin in 2020 with nothing but your laptop. Intrigued enough, I clicked on that video, watched it all the way through to the end while simultaneously getting things set up, and now I am making that passive income with this website, HoneyMiner.com. This website makes it super easy to mine Bitcoin on even the crappiest of computers, as what it does is it mines a bunch of smaller cryptocurrencies that take up less power on your computer, which then gets converted into Bitcoin, which then gets converted into dollars if you so choose. Just for signing up for this application, I got some free Bitcoin, which comes out to about 20 cents in value. So if you guys decide you want to try Bitcoin mining after watching this video all the way to the end, I will leave my Honey Miner affiliate link down below. Below in the description. Over the next seven days, I am going to leave my computer on a mining Bitcoin for 24 hours per day, and every single day I am going to give you guys an update showing you how much money I made. This is going to be a very interesting challenge, guys, but for now I'm going to take a little break, leave my computer on mining Bitcoin, and by tonight I will show you how much we've made so far. It is currently 10 13 p.m. I've literally been editing a YouTube video all day, so I apologize guys I'm super tired, but for the day one Bitcoin mining update You guys can see that we have earned a little bit over 50 cents so far Ignore the fact that it says the mining earnings have come in over three days Yesterday was when I actually signed up for the honey miner account And this is what we got as a sign up bonus and then today was actually when we started mining and for some reason it split up up over two days since I'm guessing Honey Miner is somehow in a different time zone since it's telling me we've entered November 13th and it's only 10 13 p.m. on the 12th. I am definitely going to leave the good old PC running all night mining Bitcoin while I sleep so I will check in with you guys tomorrow when I am well rested. Hello everybody, it is currently 1.26 p.m. and as you guys can see, so far we have mined a total of 0.0000418 Bitcoin, which equates to about 68 cents in value. At this rate, mining approximately 1 100,000th of a Bitcoin every single day, it will take us approximately 274 years before we mine just one Bitcoin. Clearly things aren't going too well so far, but I hope Bitcoin production speeds up, but I guess we will We'll have to wait and see over the next couple days of this challenge. 
And just like that, over the next several days, my computer mined Bitcoin at a rate slower than a tortoise racing a hare. By the end of day two of this challenge, my computer had mined a solid 0.00005478 Bitcoin. And after that, throughout both day three and four of this challenge, my PC continued mining like Bob the Builder all the way up to one thirteen thousandth of a Bitcoin, which is worth about a dollar and twenty cents in today's market. It is now day four of this challenge and as you guys can see so far we have mined a total of 0.00007576 bitcoin so far things definitely are going too well with this challenge but i've literally made one dollar and twenty cents so far in passive income doing absolutely nothing except leaving my computer running 24 hours per day what i want to do next to increase the total amount of money we make by the end of this challenge is take whatever bitcoin we've earned so far put it into the online gambling website Rubet, and boom, hopefully we double our money. This is probably a very stupid idea, but you know what guys, I'm trying to secure a quick bag of cash, so let's hop into Rubet, join Vegas virtually, and hopefully we make some money. Alright guys, I am now sitting on Rubet with some Bitcoin in the account, and now it is time to get into the first and only game we are going to be playing on Rubet, and this is a game called Crash. This is basically where you bet a certain amount of money, it begins to multiply, and you can pull out whenever you want to take profits but the only issue is the game can crash at any point and you'll lose everything i think the strategy i am going to go with is to bet literally all of our money on crash three times in a row and cash out at a conservative multiplier of like 1.25 or maybe at the max 1.5 hopefully this works because we're literally betting all of the money we made over these last four days and if things go wrong we will literally lose all of it all right guys as you can see i am now sitting on Rubet, ready to join the first game. I have an initial bet amount of $1.20, which is how much Bitcoin we've mined so far. And I also have an automatic cash out at 1.5, which we may cash out a little bit earlier on since I don't want to push my luck. So guys, with that being said, as soon as this round of Rubet gambling ends, I am going to bet on the next round and hopefully we make some money. We just placed a bet, guys. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Be greedy, be greedy. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. No, it crashed. Oh! Wow guys, that definitely didn't go as planned, but you know what? I am going to pretend I never made the stupid decision to gamble our Bitcoin mining earnings. And with that being said, I will check in with you guys in a few days when it has officially been seven days into this challenge. And I will show you guys how much I made mining Bitcoin using nothing but my computer. It has officially been seven days since I started mining Bitcoin with nothing but my PC and well, after leaving my computer running for 168 hours straight, the total amount of money we made is right behind the screen right here and it is $2.22 or 0 0.00012401 Bitcoin. Honestly guys, I wasn't really expecting a whole lot more than that since Bitcoin mining is literally 100% passive and I can't expect to become a millionaire by literally leaving my computer running all day. Honestly, I probably spent more on electricity than I actually made mining Bitcoin, but luckily I still live with my parents and they still cover that. If you want to make some money with Bitcoin, I would recommend that instead of mining it, you invest some money into it with an app like Robinhood, which will be linked in the description down below. You literally get a free stock for signing up, and at the start of this challenge, I invested a little bit over $1,100 into Bitcoin, and since then, in the last seven days, Bitcoin has gone up in price by $2,351, which leaves me with a profit of about $180. Bucks. On that note, in the next episode of this Bitcoin series, I am going to try day trading it for one week, and in case that episode is already out, you can find it right here.